It helps if I <laughs> press the button. Hi there. <laughs> I'm Carl Dacious, but you can call me Carl. Happy Thursday, yours day. Hope you all are doing delightful and lovely. Uh, I'm very excited to jump back into some uh, had in time with all of you. I really enjoyed that last night. So I was thrilled when I saw that we're playing that again. So let's jump right into it because unfortunately, this evening will be a shorter stream. So with all of that in mind, a click and a clack, and here we go again. How are you doing, Link? Charles, unnamed person. Hi, hello. Oh, if I could uh, grab it. Nice pogs. <laughs> Sweet. And I love the Beta 64 emotes. Super dope emotes, as per usual. Let me just straighten this just a smidge. There we go. Delightful. So, uh, we were still kind of making our way through Mafia Town. Because we're still very, very early on in the game. Which is exciting, I'd say, because there's still a lot more to go. At least from what I know, which isn't much about this game specifically. And like I already mentioned yesterday, so far so good as far as this game's feel and all the things that I look for in a game. Platformers, yada, 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 yada. And here's the terrifying black screen of waiting, which goes on just a bit too long without some kind of... <laughs> feedback that there's going to be something showing up but we just wait patiently with our hats on and we move forward so all is right and well with the world what there's a new thing new not Ni nyakuza metro collect 10 all new time pieces in the dangerous metro tunnels where the empress is in control oh okay well, maybe later. I've got plenty of the regular game to go, I think. Look and fly. Okay. 13%? We're already over 10% complete? <laughs> awesome. We have a cool message or announcement. Thanks to Omni. Let's take advantage of it real quick. The real hat was the friends we made along the way. You said it. <laughs> How are you doing? Good to see you, buddy. Glad you could join me for some hat in time. I can chickety check that. Okay, great. I'm good. Awesome. Happy to hear it. So let us see. Let us see. Lurk away, my friend, and best of luck on your homework. Let's jump back in. Oh, wait, she's she's a cook in something. Oh, hey! Hope you don't mind me using your kitchen. I figured I'd treat you to some nice earth food, since you're an alien and all. We are the most human-looking alien I think I've ever seen. Say, are you a steak kind of person or a veggie kind of person? Ooh, I didn't realize I was going to be asked questions like this. Steak all the way. Is that so? Well, I hope you're not looking to cook up some earthlings anytime soon. Look, just because I like steak doesn't mean I anyway, like that kind of I steak. I my dish is ready before you leave. I want to see how great a dish I can cook using an <laughs> alien stove. It literally looks the exact same as a regular stove. <laughs> just so you know, Carl, you can access the DLC content in the hub world once you get far enough. Oh, very cool, Link. Thanks for that heads up. Want a tip? Get good. Thanks, Scott. I expected nothing less from you, my friend. Good to see you and hope you're doing well. <laughs> Get good. That's the first tip of the night. Get good, gamers. So I'll be using that tip right now. Okay. Let's see what we got. The Golden Vault. I got that. <gasps> Another time rift? There are multiple time rifts? Oh, snap. Here, I think I need to scooch myself over. Ooh, just a smidge. There we go. Okay. Another time rift? Where is it? Wow, that's like right out in the open. Okay. Um, 
Do I have enough? I do. I have enough to unlock that. Let's unlock it. Heating up Mafia Town. Heating up! Let's see. Ooh. You know what this kind of reminds me of, at least visually? It reminds me of that level in Super Mario Sunshine in P Pianta. Is that, is that how you pronounce it? Pianta Village? Best chef. Ah, oh, good to see that command again. Hey, Preston, welcome. <laughs> Whoa, hello, frames. <gasps> Even the music and the way that it did the cutscene was just like Super Mario Sunshine. Like, I, you could have replaced the, like, intro level. Like, you could have replaced that chime. I think the exact amount of time that took place right there, you could have replaced it and you wouldn't have been able to tell if you'd never played this game before and never played Super Mario Sunshine. What the heck is right? Pink time rifts appear by completing relics. Oh, okay, okay. I forgot that I completed the hamburger relic, which apparently hamburgers are chairs, guys. We've been doing it wrong this whole time. And uh, I gotta say, those are some of the most delicious chairs I've ever eaten. If we're doing it wrong, <laughs> oh, it's terrible. Everyone turn on all faucets in Mafia Town. Same faucets that control the town volcano. <laughs> Was it you, child? No? No. Mafia think he saw a little oh. girl turn on all faucets. Little ah. kid, can you save Mafia Town by turning off all faucets? You know what? This is really interesting. Because these guys were the bad guys when we were partnered with, again, I still think they're tusks. Apparently she's mustache girl, but it looks like they're tusks to me. So I'm not letting that go. Those are tusks. Just saying. I know her name is mustache girl. You can't really argue with it, but I'm arguing with it. Because <laughs> they look like tusks. They're too firm. That is a crazy firm mustache. Anyway. What's interesting is I feel like, especially on this level, that whole idea of good and bad or good and evil is kind of being turned upside down in my book because isn't she kind of the evil one to turn on these fa faucets and destroy their town? Just saying. Just saying. Well, the burger relic is made of fabric. I, I didn't see that in the fine print link. <laughs> that would make sense, but... How are you enjoying a hat in time? Hey, Donnie, I am really, really enjoying it. Um, definitely so far, and it's very early, second day playing it, five seconds in, virtually, kind of. Uh, it's my favorite modern platformer I think I've, I've picked up. You know, most platformers that I've played and loved are on the Nintendo 64, and so to pick up one that's on the Nintendo Switch and was on PC, it's just like, wow, and to, and to enjoy it. Because I played a little bit of ukulele, and I'm not really itching to get back to it, as much as it pains me to say. There were certain elements they got right that are Banjo-Kazooie-esque, but it wasn't quite enough for me. But this game has been a delight. I'm definitely getting hints of Banjo-Kazooie. I'm getting hints of Mario influence, um, especially Super Mario Sunshine um, so far. So... You can't really argue with it, but I'm arguing with it. <laughs> Thanks, Link. Oh boy, okay. If you close all, if you close all water start yeah. flowing again. I forgot he does the voice acting. I don't have to do it. Okay, we have to close all the faucets. <laughs> Dude, can you guys read their signs? Here, I probably, let me get close. <laughs> oh no! Yikes! So these were the same guys who were holding the keep out signs, and now they are... Are they happy about this? They they don't look... I'm trying... I like how she's just jumping around between them. I, I can't tell their emotion here, because their faces look angry, but their dance moves say that they're j jovial, they're jolly, so... 
What's the emotion being conveyed here? Also, what is she playing with? Are those action figures? Kind of looks like it. <laughs> I love your hat. Hey, silly. Thanks, buddy. How are you doing? Yeah, it feels pretty cool. It's nice. I've been meaning to own a top hat. And, you know, one thing led to another, and I just happened to get one. So it just, it was meant to be, and it feels great. You know, there are certain things in your life that you might ask yourself or tell yourself, ah, do I really want to do that? Is it really going to be as awesome as I think it's going to be? Is it better to live with the wonder of just wondering, thinking, oh, maybe one day, that would be great. But maybe I shouldn't because what if it doesn't live up to it? Well, let me tell you, go for it because I got a top hat and it is amazing. Whoo! I'm wearing it everywhere. I'm going to the McDonald's, top hat. I'm going to the fancy five-star restaurant, six-star restaurant, top hat. I'm going to my own bathroom, top hat. You can't go wrong with a top hat. Just saying. Okay, that's awesome. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> you the man. You, see, he, this guy looks happy. You're, <laughs> he's like, oh yes, my island is encompassed in fire. This is fine. This is really fine. <laughs> He's just living it up. This is one of the few guys that's like, all right, hop to it. Okay. I was just appreciating their uh, their feels on the on the dilemma. I, or at least I think it's a dilemma. Let me tell you, the seal the deal mi mission for this act is something else. Ooh, I am very excited, Link. Oh, wrong button. It's been a full 12 hours. I forgot how to play. Where's the little swoopy thingy? All right. I like the switch in music. Oh yeah. Oh. You better be wearing it for Fancy Friday. You know, you are not the first person to say that, silly. A lot of people, uh, they've been like, are, are you wearing it for Fancy Friday? Are you, are you, are you? And so I'm like, hmm. You know what I should do? I wonder if this is the thing I can do Edit rewards? I don't want to do that right now. I want to play the game. I should have thought about, oh, what? You're going to hurt me, sleepy raccoon, while I'm trying to do cool things. You know, so here's what I'm thinking. I think this is something we can do. I think for this Fancy Friday, in celebration of the top hat and all its amazing, lovely fanciness, and just, I mean, can you really top the top hat? I mean, it's in the name. And I just figured out what the next topic for this Friday is. <laughs> anyway, but so this Friday, I'll definitely wear it. I'll tell you what, I've heard you guys loud and clear. I'm not gonna leave you hanging. I want you to be happy. I'm happy, I love wearing it, it's great. Um, so I will be wearing it for Fancy Friday. So rest assured, my friends. But in the future, for future Fancy Fridays, we're gonna have to reach a goal. And I'm thinking it's gonna be a channel points goal. So it's it's gonna have to have, you guys are gonna have to earn a certain amount of community points. That's kind of my rough idea, but that might change. But that's kind of what I'm thinking would be cool. For you guys, because I've been meaning to do a group goal thingamajig with the points, you know what I'm saying, so. Topic, follow the, sec follow the second fire, ah, I gotcha. I need to find the time rip. I keep hitting the wrong button. It's not that button, it's this one. This one, that one. Okay, right trigger. Hey, hey, Bluey, how's it going? Hi, all a hat in time. That's right, you know it. Let's see, okay. So the time rift was like right in my face, um, if I'm not mistaken. It's not over here, it's over there. Well, that was weird. You can't find the time rift in this act. It's encompassed in lava. Boiling hot magma, you say? Well, in that case, I guess I can't do it. It's under the lava. Got it. He's like, you the dude, dude. All right. Let me... ba -da -da -da. This unknown relic might match with others. Okay, that looks like a train set, so I need a train. Whoa. All right, ooh, I need to, how do I turn off this uh, thingamajig? Um, use to use your ability. I do not want to fall in the lava. 
I just keep hitting it? Okay, gotcha. Cool, I got this. Oh, <laughs> that was a little weird. Thanks, you. Oh, I'm doing awesome. I'm excited to be jumping back into this game. I just started it yesterday, and it has been fantabulous. I'm a big fan of platformers, and a lot of modern platformers that I've seen, um, Ukulele or, what is it, Lucky's 12 Tales. I played the demo of Lucky's 12 Tales, and it was okay, but I don't know. It just didn't grab me. This game has grabbed me. This game has the charm and some other sweetness that I look for in games like this. I'm really impressed so far. I was re ready for this when I see the beta on Brutal Moose. Yeah, I've heard interesting things about the beta for this game. I don't have any knowledge on that, but I want to know more. Kaboom. Kaboom. Super Lucky's Tales, my bad. Sorry, I don't know where, did I say 12 Tales? What do I, what am I talking about? Still waiting to get this game 10 or below, like on the Switch or uh, like on PC? Cause you might be able to do that on PC, but I don't know about Switch unless you buy used. Boom, ba -dum, boom, boom. Okay, I need to actually do the thing. Uh, so, oh, <laughs> don't jump into the lava, whatever you do. 12 Tales was Conquer 64 became, that's, that's right. Sorry, my brain combined a game like that that I'm sure I would have liked um, with uh, Lucky. My bad. Any? Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. So I'm playing this on Switch right now, and it is awesome. I'm a console kind of gamer because I don't have the best PCs. So makes it hard to play all the, the cool games on the, so I'm I'm all for PC Master Race, but I don't have a PC to master with the PC Master Race, so it makes it difficult. It's kind of a weird conundrum to be in, but alas, here I am. So uh, there's another thingamajig. I'm trying to remember which way is the, it's not that, it's this. No, it is that. I had it right. It's gotta be, oh, this is the thing. Okay, I was misremembering. Wow, I need to be careful. All right. Zoom. Oh, I'm glad that didn't hurt me. I fell from a pretty far way up. Did my hint help you? Also, what did I miss? Your hint helped me so much, man. I am getting good with the best of them. You missed everything. We turned one faucet and we've got a lot more to go. Let's see, I think there's one over here. I guess I should go down there. That one's more visible. I can blow that up. There's so many things to do. I love it. Give me all the things. All right. I'm going to get more money. I don't. I think I'm going to switch the scooter to the um, umbrella thingy. I don't mind running a little bit slower. It's still faster than normal. Do I just keep blowing it up on myself? I'm confused. I'm just going to stand near it and blow it up. Ba boom. Okay. Boom, da boom, boom. Cool. So, oh, so I can run over there. Sweet. Nice. Oh, I, oh, wait. Have, are you kidding me? Could I have used those the whole time and I just didn't hit the right button? Is that what you're telling me? Game? that I somehow missed an obvious button to press? Is that what you're telling me? Oh, say it ain't so. I saw a little button. Oh wait, no, it was for this, wasn't it? Okay, I missed, missed saw that. Pop goes the raccoon. It didn't bother him, interesting. See you later, okay. Brewing. Yeah, the Y was a prompt from the dive attack. attack. Sadly, I figured that out. <laughs> well, I mean, it's good I figured that out, but it, unfortunately, I can't use those uh, little pads yet. But I'm still thinking about them. I haven't forgotten. They are really pointing, aren't they? Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. 
All in due time, Scott. Okay, let's see. Oh, snap. There we go. Kaboom. Sweet, got it. And based off what it's saying, it does a checkpoint. When you uh, turn up, turn the, tu when you turn up. So we are all set. Cool. Oh, ow. I was afraid there. Maybe I'll go over this way. Ooh, what's over there? Can I zoom in? Not really. Uh, oof, that's a little scary. I'm gonna do it anyway. That guy's uh, biscuits are burning, huh? Can I help him? I don't feel like I can help him. I'm afraid I'll die if I try to help. Dude, don't worry about it, Donnie. You being here is a dream. So don't feel like you have to do more than that, my friend. So don't you sweat it. No need to apologize. Let me grab that ladder. Climb up the ladder. There we go. Man, they are really burning up, aren't they? You can help the guy by turning off the faucets. That's true. I just, I was, I hate to see him in pain. Whoa, that's strange the way the, it's stretched like that. Hey, yarn, can I do anything with that yet? No, I cannot. Oh, I accidentally turned off my cool recolor. Let's put that back on. Good question. What is for dinner, Donnie? What are you cooking, man? If you have a moment to share. Swap hat. Yeah. Right. All right, we'll just go this way then, I guess. Oh, The only, uh, if I could, so I've said a lot of positive things about this game, and I, I'm sure that I'll continue to do so. But I gotta say, one thing that I'm kind of wanting uh, for is, so I want the protagonist to be a bit more emotive and reactive than she really is, and maybe there's more to this. I have a sneaking suspicion for some reason about this, but... Maybe there's more to her, her the way... Oh, gosh. Oh, this is real bad. Okay. Ouch. Maybe there's more to her being kind of silent type, but we'll have to see. But, like, you know how a mode of Mario is. Like, I really like that, and it feels like it'd probably be fitting for this game because it's so in the vein of, like, Banjo and Kazooie. Banjo Kazooie and... Rocket Robot on Wheels and Mario, you know, Super Mario 64, Super Mario Sunshine Odyssey. I want, I, I crave that from her. I want more character. You know, she's kind of just like, oh, and that's fine, but I want a bit more. So if I could give one little piece of critique there, that's what I'd say, but I already read that. Okay. She is expressive? Okay. Um, Steam this year? Nice. Yes. Physical games are cool. You still haven't found yarn for a new hat, so you can't make a new one yet? Gotcha. Ah, I see what you're saying. She's expressive, but it's very, uh, with as grandiose as stuff like people like the Mafia are, where they're very, like, we're the Mafia and this and that, which is just perfect. I want a little bit more from her, you know? She isn't grandose enough to my taste. Think about, you know, Mario is like, it's me, Mario, and whoa! Like when he burns on the lava, like that is like intense. It's great. It maybe it's over the top, but it's done in a very tasteful, well done way. Ooh, sweet. Present, whatever this is. Oh, I found the other relic. That's perfect for that. Okay. I'm just saying that I, I'm not saying that she's not expressive at all. I'm just saying I want more. Oh, the cutscenes? Okay. Well, that's different. 
Um, I would agree with you with the cutscenes. She's been expressive enough in the cutscenes, but I'm talking about gameplay. The primary place where you interact with her. Right here. See, like, she just got burned and she was like, yeah, which is good. That was great, but I don't know. And it maybe it doesn't need to be this. I'm not saying it needs to be like Mario, but I don't know. I'm just saying I want a little more oomph. Aha, chicken. Tomato Parmesan. Sounds delicious. And you can't tell. That isn't true, and that would be nasty. I couldn't tell. So I was like, yes, sounds delicious, Donnie. Okay, let me find those faucets, I guess. Oh, go this way. Jump up here. Yes. Okay. I, I can't go in there, I imagine. Right. So there's a faucet way over there. Not sure how I'm going to get over there. <laughs> wow, that quote, Donnie. Nice one. The little touches. Exactly, Blue. That's what I'm talking about. Even if you own it onto your download, will it download? Ooh, that's a good question. Does I, I don't use Steam an awful lot. Can anyone else answer that? I love how many quotes you have. <laughs> Thanks, man. I I only hope to make more and more. <laughs> there, uh, it's one of my favorite things that I've set up. I really I really like that. It's pretty cool, and it's really fun to see people's reactions who weren't here for their uh, initial saying out loud. Some of them, people were like, what? 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 How did that happen? Those are some of the uh, out of context stuff that Scott likes to clip or quote, I should say. Yes, offline mood. Sweet, that's how it should be. If you're chained to always having an, an internet connection, that would be really sad. Look at this poor guy burned it up. Okay, let's try to help. So I saw some... There's a faucet. Okay. Uh, you could get up a bit higher. Ooh. It used to be a river of water. Hey! What do we got here? We couldn't raid, so here we are. <laughs> Gamers and ed well, oh, you couldn't, you couldn't raid uh, on what on the Dame Hers channel? Is that what that is? <laughs> hey guys, welcome the Game Hers. Hey Game Hers. <laughs> By the way, that name is just perfect. I love it. How is your stream on the game Game Hers channel? I feel like I'm saying it wrong, even though I know that that's what's intended because it's punny and funny, but. We couldn't raid, so here we are. You guys are awesome. Thanks for being here. <laughs> there it is for you. Hope I can't hear it. See if I can fix it real quick. Just in time for next time. And let me switch the thing to just to be extra careful. Sweet. I wish there was a way to make it always work. So fun. I'm glad I get to watch you play Hat in Time. Hey, thanks, David. I'm glad you're here, too. Glad you're all here. Thanks for the raid. It's a raid. It's a raid. It may not say raid, but it's a raid. Thank you guys so much. So it didn't trigger the raid. So, all right, Esther, do your after stream ritual. Here's a shout out for you. Esther's awesome. So she was on the Game Hers channel, so apparently you can't raid off that, but check out her main channel, where she hangs out most of the time. Thank you for bringing everybody over. I'm assuming you did. And also, I saw David was in the bunch. David's awesome, and Donnie has been hanging out, cooking up a storm tomato water noodle man, something like that. So there, there's uh, Donnie. Oh my goodness, and I just saw the Admiral Egg Roll himself, so get all the shout outs, friends. Get all the shout outs. All right, you guys rock. Where am I? Let's, let me, <laughs> let me find those faucets. Deshush, my boy. <laughs> I'm assuming that's exactly how you said it, Matt. Deshush. 
<laughs> I don't know why I became a. <laughs> How do you say it, the name right? Is it uh, is it Pianta or Pianta? But <laughs> I love doing that. Oh my gosh! Don't do that. Just sleep in peace. Haha! -ha. Couple wax and it's turned off. Does the lava start to go away? It does not. Okay. Ah! No! Oh, well, that was interesting. Ah! Ho, ha, ho, ho, ho! What the heck? <laughs> Sorry, man. All right. Uh, I need health badly. All right. Run, run, run! There's health up there, right? Totally. Totally. Grab the ladder. Okay. Fanta? <laughs> what? Want a Fanta? Don't you wanna want a Fanta? Don't you wanna? No. <laughs> oh, it's gotta be over here. It's a huge memory hog on Switch? For what? Oh, oh, it's that much? That's why you get the physical edition, my guy. Heck yeah. I'd show you the, the case or the game, but the game might stop working if I take it out. Oh my goodness, we have an announced my message from the Kimball Donald. Let's do it, shall we? All right. The GameHer channel has just sent a raid. Now watching this channel won't be a downgrade. Though it lacks a green witch, it is still sublime. If we can't have BK, we'll take hat in time. Well said, well said. I love it. Perfect, perfect. Never cease to amaze me with your great announce my messages, Donnie. You know what? I'm going to just say it. I'm going to throw it out there. And if you guys don't like it, you can try to send it back. But sorry, no return to senders here. But I have to say, Donnie, I think you've consistently delivered my favorite announce my messages. So gold star special badge that I can't do because Twitch doesn't have special special badges for some reason. Wouldn't that be a cool idea to allow a streamer to give certain badges to certain chatters for being certain special flavors of awesome? That would be pretty cool. But uh, anyway, so you'll just have to know in your head and in your heart that you get that badge. <laughs> Fanta, Fanta. <laughs> Do not you want to. <laughs> I like how I can hide beneath my top hat. <laughs> Whether I'm giggling or I'm in shame. I'm fancy either way. <laughs> well, you see, Carl, the game didn't have a physical edition. What? Oh, it didn't always have a physical edition. Ah, that's a good call. That's a good call, but it does now, and I have it. <laughs> That's a happy laugh, not an evil laugh. I got happen time on hap happen time. Oh, it's hap to an end. Uh, on Switch with all the DLC on sale on the eShop for $25, so that's why I have it digitally. I understand. Thanks for the info. I'm glad to learn. Absolutely. I know you're thinking someone else, but I'm taking the credit this time. It's Grunty speaking through me. I can take no credit. Oh, but you can. And you will. At least I hope you will. Back with a snack. Or, or was it Backle with a Snackle? I like that better. Backle with a Snackle. Welcome back. Enjoy your Snackle. Snackle up uh, with your... Uh, I, I was trying to figure out something with cheese nips, but it, it, I felt like it was going to turn out not good, so I stopped. So enjoy your cheese nips. A physical, much more than digital. I get you. This them spicy deals for the Fanta Fanta. Don't you want it to work? You have to mispronounce Fanta. Oh, Fanta Fanta instead of Fanta. Yeah. And not pronounce "Don't you want it" correctly, which fully spelled as "Do you not want to?" <laughs> I've just thought it was a catchy jingle, like most things. It doesn't always have to make sense. Oh, I'm snackling. <laughs> But yeah, it's the same reason why I have Cadence. I totally get it. All the digital downloads, they're cool because you don't have to switch out the game, but they take up space on your memory cards. And then if Nintendo servers ever shut down, well, I guess you don't own the game anymore. Woo. 
the the lone tear goes down. Rest in peace, all the <laughs> the Wii Shop Channel games that can't be bought anymore, but are probably available online somewhere, totally legitimately somehow. We can only dream, my friends. Okay, I seriously need help. I seriously need help. Uh, fly. Okay, good thing I. Okay. Oh, I got it. I didn't even know it was over here. Ooh, kick the can. See, here's another little fun thing you can do in this game that I just learned about. You can kick the can. What more could you want? Like, they didn't have... They spent time and effort with this little animation. This little... The little art. Oh, and there goes the can. See, I love that. That is attention to detail. That is dedication. That is love. A labor of love. How can you not love it? You know, that's what I'm saying. That's what, it's little things like that and it's small and I get it. Oh my gosh. Really? <laughs> but it makes me appreciate this game and love it more because I don't feel like games get that love and dedication always. Now, this isn't always the case. You definitely can see that in games like Mario Odyssey. I feel like in a lot of Nintendo games, you know, they will include little Easter eggs and this and that. And I'm not saying that it never happens, but maybe I'm just missing it. And if I am, tell me, because I want to know about all the cool things in new games too. <laughs> I'm glad you like Carl the Pog, Esther. It was fun to make, and it's a, a fun feeling to have. So I'm I'm glad you're enjoying it. I know I am. Oh, just in time for Valentine's Day. So much love. Oh yeah, just in time. Probably probably not blue. I don't know for sure, but this game had its kick kick what kickstart away before ukulele was even announced. Really, I didn't know that. And it was developed over a longer period of time. Okay, so that's probably why it's more fleshed out. Just overall feels like it was really given a lot of thought. Yeah, that's them some good deals, Luigi. Yeah, emotes, pog. Pog on a log. Poggy on a doggy. All right, what am I doing? There we go. I said this yesterday, but I want you guys to hear it again. That little sound effect, percussion, reminds me of WarioWare Smooth Moves. And makes me, it makes me happy. It makes me happy. Where am I? I am very afraid. Okay. Go, go, go. Okay. That could have been bad. So is the faucet in the lava? It, that can't be it. Maybe it's down there somewhere. All right. Uh, ooh. Yeah, it's, it's right there. How could I have missed it? All right. They're trying to hit me, aren't they? Those guys are meaner than I would have thought. Yikes. I don't feel bad for beating them up when they land on my head somewhat. It seems like it's an accident, but it feels like it's on, pers on purpose. Right, so we got that. Okay. Pog on a log. You said it. Pog at the... <laughs> I'm, I'm going to be keeping my eyes open for that. Naming them after David, of course. <laughs> it's running pretty well. There, there's some frame drops on occasion, but overall, it runs pretty smoothly. Now, I will tell you, it might be hard for you, or harder for you guys to notice because um, I stream at 30 frames per second, but uh, I'm assuming this game runs at 60, so who knows? Here, I got a ball for you. Oh. Well, there goes the ball. I dropped the ball, friends. Whoops. Okay. <laughs> feet pocket feet. 
<laughs> Runs well. Yes, the load times are a bit long. Agreed. How am I going to get over there? Mm, let's go this way. Ah, no. No, please. Okay. Back to the top we go. Ooh, I found help. Yeah. How, how high can I go off this thing? Come on. Ooh, that's pretty good. Ooh, shouldn't have done that. Oh, it worked out. Okay. That little umbrella thing's coming in handy. All right. I think if I run... That's still not good enough. Oh, all right, I saw a piece of health there. So I'm gonna grab that real quick. Maybe I'll just go over here and... Ooh, I missed this somehow. Okay. <laughs> Mafia sabotage. Ooh, this must be where the mustache, and I use that term loosely, girl was hiding out. Nice hat. Hey, thanks to Coach B. Good to see you. How are you? That's true. I, I know what you're saying, Luigi. Now, I will say that 60 FPS looks super smooth, but in the right context, 30 FPS looks great. And I'll give you a perfect example, at least in my mind. So, Ocarina of Time runs at 20 FPS. That's right, 20, uh, at least natively on the Nintendo 64. I like the way that looks because guess what? That's how I grew up seeing it. So seeing it run at 30 or even 60 is cool, but it almost looks wrong or weird because I'm not used to it being that buttery smooth. Plus, with the I will say this, this impacts my feelings on it too. In the examples that I saw it running at a higher FPS, um, it affected other elements of the gameplay, like time or the length of a day, which is no good in my book. That totally uh, messes it up. If it didn't affect that, I might feel differently, but... As it is, keep it at 20 FPS. It looks and runs just fine by me. And it feels wrong to say that, but you know, if it works, it works. That's the US and Japanese version. Gotcha. Pow. Oh, it runs at 15? Oh my gosh. Thanks for that clarification, Link. I didn't realize that. That's too low, I'd say. 20 is pushing it. 20 is just barely, but, but hey, whatever works. Artus, I, what? No cheese for me. <laughs> this is what I was trying to say. All right. Well said, Carl. Also, Ocarina runs at 20 FPS. That's a prime example. Well, thank you. If I do say so. Hey, hey, Gecko. How's it going? There we go. I want to use these little, uh, no, don't jump off. That was almost really bad. I was pining for a remake of Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask in the Breath of the Wild engine. Ooh. Obviously reimagined a bit and remade, but can you imagine how fun that would be? That would be great. Um, that would be really cool. I, so here's the hesitancy. The hesitant, hesitancy. My brain. Here's the hesitancy. Hesitancy. It's just hard to hear myself. Hesitancy. There we go. That I, you're hearing in my voice. So I just love the original look and feel and stuff of Ocarina of Time and especially Majora's Mask. And anything that starts to deviate, I start to be like, nah, that isn't right. Like, there are lots of changes they made in uh, Majora's Mask um, 3D that I was like, eh, this isn't right. So um, I'm a little bit nitpicky. Oh my gosh, I did, did the exact same thing I did before, like a big doof. Um, I want to get over there though. There's got to be a better way. But I do think it would be awesome. I'd love to see it, Donnie. So I'm not saying never. I'm just saying, ah, given the option between a true remake or even just releasing the original versus uh, a Breath of the Wild remake of those games, 
I'm kind of leaning towards just the original just because I love the original so much, but I would hate to squander the opportunity because I'm sure it would be awesome. I totally prefer an HD remake before, okay. It would be so cool, okay. We're on the same page as per usual. Have no fear. <laughs> Hexitancy. I know, hesitancy, hesitancy. It's not that hard. Speaking is easy. <laughs> what game have you bought? Thought, wow, they put a lot of touches in this game for the first time. Mine will probably be Humongous Entertainment or Reader Rabbit. I'm, I'm not familiar with those. Um, they put a ton of touches in this game. Ooh, that's a good... I'm feeling that way about this game, but there are lots of games... Um, upon reflection, as a kid, you just kind of accept it and don't really question it or compare it. You just go, oh, this game is awesome, and it has this little fun thing in it um, that I like. You don't really think about the intricacies of this stuff, but I, this is the first game in a long time that I've went, wow, they have a lot of heart in this game, and I really am enjoying it. Wow, that's a long way down. Let's go! I went for it. I regret nothing. So balloons? Let's see. If you were to compare, say, the NTSC and PAL versions of Sonic 1, you would see the difference between... Ah, I got you. Yeah, no, that does affect the frame rate. The different stuffs. Like TV in uh, Europe with PAL and stuff runs at 25, 25, 25 frames per second, and that's fine. The good thing about that over there is it's a full 25 frames per second as opposed to NTSC, which is actually 29.97. And it's really interesting why it's that way, but they also, in my opinion, majorly goofed up because the moment you start to have most of a frame but not the full frame weirdness, they just made things weird as a result of that, which I don't feel like they should have, but, oh, this is gonna be freaky. This is some platforming that I just messed up. Oh boy. We made it. Yeah, yeah, we made it. There we go. I don't know what the little coin's gonna do for me, but I'll try. Boom. So that's why I'd want reimagining. I see. That makes sense. 3D remake, remakes were supposed to be the originals, but slightly modernized. And so the changes were bad. Gotcha. That's a good call. Either go full in or full out as far as changes go. I think that you're right. I will, well, for the most part. And I think this next thing that I'm about to say, I think you'll agree with me. So there were certain aspects, like quality of life improvements, I would say don't have to necessarily be changes. They can just be improvements without fundamentally changing the gameplay. Here's what I mean. Let's take a quick moment to talk about this because I think it's cool, very quickly. So, in Majora's Mask 3D, they added the ability to go to a certain hour instead of having to jump all the way to night or the morning. That's great. That is a great quality of life change. Love it. No problems with that. That doesn't really affect the gameplay all that much other than making things better for the player. Perfect. Here's a change they made that I didn't like. The Stone Tower Temple boss battle. Did not like that change. Was it cool? Sure, it was cool, but it wasn't as good as the original, in my opinion. Um, and it's something that I think of, should have went untouched. So quality of life improvement changes to modernize it, great. But actual game changes that change the way that the game progresses. And again, you can pick and choose. You can argue about what that means, but... I hope that that example made it clear what I'd like versus what I wouldn't like. I would, I'd hate to squander in general. That sounds like... <laughs> yeah, definitely not. Uh, it doesn't really sound, sound pleasant, does it, Matt? Squander the gander of the geese. Squander and gander and geese are words that belong together. And quack! That one's for you, Matt. Like expressions, mini games, replay value. Okay, here I've got one for you, um, Blue or Bluey. Uh, Rocket Robot on Wheels, which is also sim similar to this game. Uh, 
Ocarina of 3D, Ocarina of 3D, Ocarina of Time 3D, they did. I completely agree, Link. Like adding fishing, yes. Added nothing. I mean, I don't even mind adding the fishing. I mean, it didn't add much, but I don't mind that addition as much as I mind fundamentally changing some of the core elements of the game. But gyro, but maps, those were good. But fixing things is often kind of bad. Exactly. Yes, fixing. Well, it just depends on what your definition of fixing is, right? So they fixed the boss battles and added the eyeballs everywhere. I don't think that fixed it. I thought, I think nothing was broken. But it all depends on your perspective, right? <laughs> oh, the Zora changes were the worst. Yeah. What's the, oh wait, actually the Deku spinning was bad too. Yeah, both of those were horrible changes. What system do you like the most? PC, Nintendo, uh, play, uh, PlayStation grew up playing the most. Nintendo, without a doubt. Never heard of it. Never heard of it? Oh, see? So we had a talk last Fancy Friday, if I'm not mistaken, it was last one. Hey, hey. Rift token, nice. Um, where we talked about what's the most underrated game of all time. And so my pick was Rocket Robot on Wheels. And so it's a Nintendo 64 platformer that was awesome. It had its own lovely, oh my gosh, why do you have to slip and fall? Ooh, that was too scary. That was very close. I need some health badly. Uh, it came in a spiffy red cartridge and it's my personal favorite platformer on the Nintendo 64. Now, and this is coming from a guy who adores Banjo-Kazooie and set, and while Rocket Robot on Wheels is my favorite platformer on the Nintendo 64, I think Banjo-Kazooie is the best platformer. So those don't have to be mutually exclusive, just saying. I really need help. I think there's some over there maybe. Here's hoping. Maybe I left one over here for myself. Nope. I need the help, please. <laughs> I thought I had another jump. How did I not have another jump? I don't understand. No. Welcome back. I'll give it a look. Please do. I think you'll uh, you'll enjoy it. And I definitely plan to play it on stream at some point, without a doubt. I don't think that really hurt me all that much. I don't think they took away the faucets that I took care of. I think I only have one faucet left, and that's the ridiculously hard faucet to get to, I think. Oof. Oof a doof, but we're okay. This game is pretty forgiving with things. And so I, I don't know about you guys, I'd love to know, so please tell me, but I have mixed feelings about that. Because obviously, since I died, I don't want to have to redo what I've already done. So I like the checkpoints in that scenario. But in another very real way, I want to feel challenged. I want to feel like, hey, if I wasn't good enough to get all the faucets, maybe I should restart until I get it. You know, so I have mixed feelings about this approach, but I do think that it's more friendly to newer players. So overall, I'm gonna give it one thumbs up because I think it's probably the best choice, but my uh, nostalgic self, or I don't know if I can say nostalgic self, my inner gamer, gamer, growing up, is like back in my day, I had to redo this level over and over and over and over again from the start until I got it right. And while that isn't necessarily the right way to do it, it was at the time. It's it's definitely not now. I, oh wait, I don't want to make that mistake again. I've done this so many times. Um, how should I do this? I'm not doing this the right way. Um, let me think for a second. But anyway, so I think they made the right choice, but I have mixed feelings about it. If you're able to play that on Citra, I don't have that. I only have a regular 3DX, 3DS XL. A ton of things. I have heard about uh, the 
the fixes. I've actually got that page, or I've, I did at one point saved, and I wanted to return to it to play the real edition, so to speak, or their fixed edition, but I haven't gotten around to it. But way to bring it up, Link. Depends on how long is the level. I, I hear that, Bluey. That does affect it. Hat in time gets challenging. Awesome. I'm excited. Um, it's been fairly challenging as it is. Let me see if maybe I need to jump sooner. See, I lost. Maybe that's my mistake. So if I jump and then do it, I have that. But if I jump, okay. So if I'm sprinting, if I'm sprinting and then I jump, I lose it. That's what I'm seeing. So that's what's happening. I only get one jump out of the sprint jump. So maybe I should change this to a scooter and I can go even faster, not the camera. That will not help me. You're going at this wrong? Am I? Well, you know what? I like to say, try, try until you... Yeah! That was the way, I knew it. <laughs> That's how you do this. Oh wait, maybe it's not. I was so sure. <laughs> I, got, I got where I wanted to be, but... Hey, Pixel Knight, welcome. Well, I highly recommend it. This is my second night playing it, and I'm really, really enjoying it. If you like platformers, then I really think you should go for it. So I'm guessing I need to go that way, I see. Well, let me go that way. Maybe I can kind of skip those balloons by jumping on the uh, scooter here. All right. It's back that way, right? Yeah, here we go. So you're getting an, a look at what I would do as a kid. <laughs> I would constantly, I would do things over and over and over again until it worked or until I thought of a new idea. And in this case, I thought of a new idea for the same method and it happened to kind of work even though it's not the right way. I can tell, I think it's this way, but we're doing it anyway. Oh, well, I had to sacrifice a hit point, but it was worth it. I think. All right. Awesome. Easy peasy. Ooh. I think that's it. Wait, is there more? Okay, I was about to say, that felt like that was supposed to be it. Hooray! Is it gonna just change into water or? No. Wait. There's water, is it gonna affect it? Probably not. All right, it, it would make sense that I'd have to travel back cautiously. Man, it's hard to land on that thing properly. All right. Cool. Hey, Carrie. Go on four day weekend. Oh, you have a four-day weekend? Congrats, that's awesome. How are you doing? Mafia Cooks, number one in everything. <laughs> we'll see, okay. Now it's more or less like sunshine. Works for me, I love sunshine. I'm definitely getting sunshine vibes from this game. This level is just like that Pianta Village level in a lot of ways. Woo! Yeah! That's what I'm saying. Woo! Climb the ladder. All right. Cool. Help. That's the better way. Ouch. We haven't had much sunshine here lately. Aw. Yeah. Hey, don't worry. The sun will come out tomorrow. Bet your bottom. Go uh -huh. Don't feel sorrow, there'll be song. <laughs> so just keep on keeping on. Let's see. Uh, we're almost there now. Don't. You can get burned on those torches, so don't do it. Ooh, that sounds great. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Woo! Here we go. Good job, guys. And then we have the uh, rift. Ooh, look at this, they're so happy. <laughs> uh, 
I, I just need to pre. Oh, they have a gold statue of me now? Wow. You did it! Small child saved Mafia Town! Now Mafia no longer need to eat lava for breakfast. Amazing! Amazing! Please, take this as trophy. You <laughs> what did I. Wait, did you give me that? Oh, wait, did I interrupt him? Oh, wait, it's right here. Awesome. They like me now. I mean, it makes sense. I did save Mafia Town. Here we go! See, that's what I'm saying. I want... I want Hat Girl. That's her uh, actual name because she doesn't give a name. I want Hat Girl to say something there. You know? I mean, I know that there's kind of a victory chime, but I want, I want something there. I want the... That, yeah, you know, that victory for her to show that, that happiness. Hit kid, that too. I just want a little more, a little more. All right. Oh, new world unlocked and I haven't even entered the second world. I need to get the rift. So I'm, I'm getting the impression from this game that will be able to tackle each world one by one and won't have to go back, which is pretty cool. <gasps> Another time rift? How many time rifts are there? Holy moly. Cheating the race, why is it locked? You're missing a key item. Ooh. Maybe I'll just go to, um... I don't know. I'll go to the golden vault and look for that time rift. It, I don't have to be... Oh, I should have looked at the time rift before I uh, went in. Oops. <laughs> hey, welcome, Neutron. Exactly, Pixel Knight. Yeah, if you like N64 platformers, this is the game for you. I've really, really, really enjoyed it so far. It's, it's a lot better than ukulele, again, so far. And... I mean, ukulele was pretty good. I, I want to go back to it at some point, give it another shot, but this game has a lot more charm and heart and just I, I am liking it a lot more. What do you think she should say? Just, I don't know. It feels, this has a very Sunshine-esque feel among other games that I've already mentioned, like Banjo-Kazooie, Rocket, and... Um, what else? Uh, the music on this stage with that boom boom reminds me of Outset Island like Wind Waker. So this feels like a very Wind Waker inspired track. Um, but uh, I just want her to cheer or be like, yeah, or something, something like that. Something uh, where I know that she's excited that she's gotten another timepiece. But that's just me. Of the art card titles. The, yeah, they're so good. All right. Ooh, it's in the tunnel. I know where that is. It, what's cool, too, is when you... Oh, I'm stuck. Okay. When you start to play this level enough that you know where things are, or at least you think you know where things are, that's where they get you. All right, so it should be over here somewhere. I think. Oh, we've got the mean birds on this level. Forgot about those guys. I feel like it's been a while since I've seen them. Um, maybe this way. I know I know where it's at, but where? Hat Kid mainly only does expressions? Yeah. So that's what I'm saying. Like, uh, even Link, even Link, a silent protagonist that doesn't actually say words still is very, very expressive with his voice. Um, I mean, and obviously with his face and the expressions and everything. And that allows me to, to connect better with him. And I, so I long for a little bit more of that with Hat Girl. I, I don't, I'm, I still feel connected. I'm not trying to diminish what's here, but I just want a little bit more. It feels like it needs a little more to me. As someone who loves Mario and Link, Boom. 
This also gives me Wind Waker vibes. Hey, well, I'm glad you agree. I can see that laugh or scream yet. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. I, I just think it would add a little extra something. All right, so I just ran through here. I thought I knew the way, but it clearly. Oh wait, I might have enough money to, uh, or pawns. I might have enough pawns to actually get something from this guy. So let's look. Ooh, can I go under here? How do I dive? I don't think I can dive. Oh, I didn't mean to beat you up, but now I'm gonna have to. Boom, boom. I think it's over there, yeah. Uh, it's easiest if I just do this number, I think, so I'm gonna... Oops. Here we go. Here we go. Please, disregard Jeez. my twitchy behavior. My body has been to places that have left a permanent mark. Ooh. Oh, I don't have enough for the mumble badge. I want the mumble badge. Hold Y for a beam attack. Hmm. I'm gonna save up for the mumble badge. Mumble, 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 mumble badge, because I want that. All right, I've got to find that area. I've been to it a million times. I could, couldn't help but go to it earlier, and now I can't find it. Uh, it's over here, isn't it? Beam attack. Attack girl. Girl is used to describe... Girl is used to describe the player two character? Yeah, what's the player two character? How do how does a co-op person help you? Wait a second. Maybe it's over here. Wait, I feel like I've been through all this. Maybe it's lower. It's gotta be lower. Yeah, it's over here, I think. I can't remember where it's at. This level's a lot bigger than you'd think. Mumbo back. Eat them, boke them. You know it, Link. I want it. Boobity boo, boobity boo. Eat them, boke them, eat them, boke them, eat them, boke them, ye bo bow. Ye bo how. What is that? Ooh, that's a. Is this new? This wasn't here before. What does that say? I'm gonna read the sign. Black market? Ooh. Black Market is Mafia exclusive. Ooh. Let me in. I guess. I can't because it's Mafia exclusive. Yeah, I've, I've heard about that, um, Pixel. And uh, I've heard really cool things about the uh, Luigi mode, or people have modded the game to allow that to come back somewhat, so that's pretty neat. Thanks for a lurking. Appreciate it. Alright, let's see. How am I going to get up there? I don't have the, the ability to grab that little thingamajig, unfortunately. I've been in. Mm. Oh, hello. Present for me. Ooh, an alien thing. Nice. Ooh, I just ran right off. Yeah, ooh, throw the thing. Give me all the pods. I need, what, uh, 430 more? I thought I would climb that pole. I did not. It was real. It was real. After all this time, we know, and it's awesome. All right, cool. What are you looking at? The seagull? He's still mad at the seagull. Maybe this will shoot me in the right direction. Actually, no, we're so close. It's up over this way. Not going to do it this time. Here we go. It's over here. 
I can see it. There's the kind of Mario 64 wall jumps. Okay, there's something over here first. This is new too. I don't remember this being here. Oh, what's this? Oh snap, I'm this is a time thing, isn't it? Ooh, too slow. Love your hat, Carl. Thanks, David. I'm enjoying it too. It feels good. It feels right. <laughs> Uh, ooh, the uh, blow em up. Kaboom! Sweet. Almost need just 400 more for the, the mumbly thingy. Eat them, boke them. All right, so here's the rift in time. I can heal it right there, yeah. Do it. Here we go. I remember loving the other level, so. Ooh, looks like she's got a cookie. That thing is glowing. Wish you could buy a Sprint hat in real life. <laughs> yeah, me too. That'd be great. Because uh, having some kind of super powered run would definitely be come in handy, I think. Because just running without any kind of super power is wild and difficult. Oh, I got the checkpoint already. Yeah, I love these little time rift levels. These are very Super Mario. Whoa! I did not expect that. <laughs> these are very Super Mario uh, Sunshine-esque, and I dig it. Just let it happen. Ooh, cookies. Nice. Oh! <laughs> I was trying to pro-gamer it, guys. Sorry. I'll pro-gamer pro it this time. There we go. There we go. It's so fun to be able to just sprint. Oops. Got ahead of myself there. Oh. Ah! Missed it. This is interesting how it rotates with it. Here we go! See, I just want that. I want that cheer. Ooh, we get hat flare. <laughs> Chance time. Here we go. Okay. Uh, hat flare. Claim this prize or I could get other things. What do you guys think? Should I claim the hat flare or should I go for something else? Tell me now. You could have blown that thing up with the... The thing with the tape on it? What thing? I would use that explosion hat? What? What tape? Oh, do I need to go back? Was it in this level? Chance time, exactly. Have you tried Frogger 2? I can't say I have, Bluey. Sounds fun, but I did enjoy Frogger. Oh, he did? Ah, okay. I, that would make sense. I'm getting some certain vibes that are great. I would say yes, but I don't know. You know the thing by the one box you blew up? There have been a lot of boxes I blew up, so I'm not sure which exact one. I think this time I'm going to claim the hat flare. Ooh, what's this? It's a little flower? Is that what I'm seeing? Uh, with a little thing on the back? Interesting. All right, I'm gonna press LZ. Can I go back? Oh, I can't, okay. I was like, I'll trade it in. <laughs> no, it, you know, once you get it, you got it. Nothing you can do. The last box you blew up before the time rift. Oh, what, I, I must have missed something? I think you will love it? I would say yes, but I don't know. I mean, I think I would, based off what uh, you said. I'll have to go back. I'll, uh, I'll, I'll go back. We'll, we'll find it. Don't worry. It's really wanting me to go there. But I've got something to do. I've got to go to that, get that other time rift as well. So we will go to the Golden Ball again. Gold. I love 
gold. <laughs> All right, let's see. So, I missed something, did I? Well, we'll have to fix that, won't we? Any day now, okay. <laughs> that's the only downside, is it does take a, a second or two to load, but that's not too bad. Ta-da, okay. All right, so is it only hat flare for that particular hat? How I change the flare? Is it with this? No. Oh, I see. I see. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. All right. Let's try to remember how we got there. We need to go down. We were up too high before. Whoa. Hello. Goodbye. Hey, cool. I hope you're feeling snazzy with your new haircut. I know for me, it's always mixed feelings. It always feels better. Hey, hey, I've got lots of pawns. The flare are separate hats. Ah, I gotcha. Here we go. Okay. Oh, it's not this way. Still needs to be lower. Oops. Maybe farther down? Not there. This way. I somehow went to the perfect area. This is perfect. Alright, so let's blow this area up first, I guess. So, boom, ponds for days. Oh, let me do this right. Go fast. Go fast. Yay! Oh, cool. I did it. That puzzle right there felt very much like Rocket Robot on Wheels. Woo! Loved it. Love it. Okay. remember those stairs being like that, but... Oh, Alright, uh, what was... Uh, what were you saying I should blow up over here, Link? That was it, then? Was it the... Was that the thing you wanted me to do? Is there anything over here? No cheese. All right. <laughs> the staircase was it? Okay, cool. I thought I thought that might be it. Just making sure. Cool. I didn't mess it up that time. Actually, I don't think I've have I opened this. This doesn't feel like I've opened this. Wow, six. That's a lot. But it has something cool. Oh, there's one right here. So four more to go. There's a lot actually right here in front of my face. Aha. All right. I forgot the puzzle. <laughs> gotcha. Yeah, I like that. I like those kind of puzzles. Oh, this way. That thing. Right there. Four. Oop, I see one more. Where's the last one? See the last one. Is it here? Nope. Might be important. Who really? We'll see. Oh, it's right there. How, do I, how did I miss it? It was just hanging out right there. Cool. All right, where's the other time rift? Oh, it's right there. Okay. We're right near it. This is actually perfect. Okay. Feels nice when my hair gets too long. Are you boy? Are you happy that you got your hair cut then, Pixel Knight? Hey, a relic? Or no, it's a coin. 
Cool. All right. Yeah, so this... Oh, wait a second. That's the place, but I don't see it. Wait a second. Have I already been to that rift? I think it was already... I already did that. That's why. Ooh, give me all the coins. Oh, I can't blow that up. Okay. Cannon. It's cannon. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, hello. Whoa. What just happened? I like how they they just have no on their shirt. <laughs> no. That's going to be a... No. No. No, no. Okay. So it, it brought us to the other side. But I still haven't gotten that time rift. No, you have not gotten that time rift. I haven't. But that was the place... Maybe there's another place? There's a place where I can go Where time rifts go and I feel good Gotta be here somewhere Maybe I need to go back over there? Maybe I missed something Kaboom Go back around. Kaboom. Cool. All right. And we'll just keep making our way downtown. Wearing cool hats, blowing up boxes, and we're homebound. Ooh, this right here, very Super Mario Sunshine esque. I love it. Ooh, there's something cool right there. This is new, isn't it? Do they keep changing this level? Because I don't remember this. Or did I just not go over here before? That is possible. Ooh, beach, beach ball. Beach ball in it. Partey! Gotta get up there. Ooh, I did not mean to fight you, dude. My bad. Sorry. <laughs> Ooh. Oh. Hey! hey. All right, sleep well, Scott. Appreciate you being here, buddy. I will catch you on the flipty flip flip side. Sweet. You haven't explored the level all the way? Gotcha, thank you. <laughs> I like how happy they are right there. Mafia number one and then a lobster, heck yeah. And kick the beach ball too. Ooh, there it is. Interesting, it's higher than I remember. Oh, okay. That's weird. I'll, I'll jump into it with the beach ball, then they'll have to let me in. All right, here we go. Come on. This probably totally isn't worth it, but I need to. <laughs> I got it. I got it. I had it with me the whole time. <laughs> that poor little crab. <laughs> Fine. You win. What the heck? Cannot seem to get up there. Did I just see a crab spontaneously combust on the beach chair? I didn't know it was that kind of vacation. Okay. There we go. It's a lot harder than it looked to get up there, believe me. Ooh, this one looks different. This isn't the snowy area. Mm. Ooh, the music just got a lot more intense here. Well, I thought for a second those were like bone birds instead of just seagulls, but no, it's just a dark area. I was like, where, where did we go? Ooh, this is foreboding. What's happening. Talk to you. Hello, little child. This is Mafia Time Rift. 
timepiece hit Mafia in head, and now Time Rift filled with Mafia thoughts and dreams. <laughs> oh, okay. To the story Time Rift? Huh. This Time Rift is simple. Simple like Mafia. Just how Mafia like. <laughs> Rules of Time Rift. If you die, you start over. You need Rift Pawns to go deeper. Rift Pawns? That is all the rules. Please, tread carefully in Mafia Time Rift. Mafia like to experience past. Hmm, this is interesting. Okay, so that's the entrance, I assume. This is a weird place. So let's do it. Okay. Here we are. Three. Cap Kingdom? It does. It is like that. I agree. There are optional stuff to collect and you already missed one? I already missed one? No! Can I go back? I hate missing things. SS none of your business. <laughs> okay. Hecaroni. That stinks. Can I blow up these wine things? Yeah. How did I already miss it? Darn it. I didn't look carefully enough, huh? So I can already go. There's stuff like this that I can get. Whatever that is. I'm assuming there must have been one... Should I go back and re re enter? Is that what I need to do? There's an extra one. Okay. I'm assuming you can't go back. Well, I'm just going to progress. I think I got everything I can. I don't see anything sticking out at me. Hmm. Not sure if you can. Oh, well. You win some, you lose some, you miss stuff sometimes. Okay. We're beating you up, that's what's happening. Oh, come on. Got him. Okay. This is really... Uh, this is a pretty big shift in tone. Interesting. And I'm sure there must have been one of those little map things that I missed. Hecaroni. I'm going to have to go all the way back just to get all of them. That's the worst. You thought it was a fish? <laughs> nice. <laughs> nope, it's an umbrella. That guy is just a cheerer honor. I'm assuming this guy is too. Yeah, he's fine. Huh, interesting. I, I can't get over there, can I? Doesn't look like it. There's another thing I can get. Oh, that wasn't too hard. I think that's it. Wait, there's something up there I need to get. Can I even get up there? Surely. You just have to believe. Alright, uh... Well, there's something over here, isn't there? Oh, wait, I've already been up here. Okay, I'm good. I think I got everything. Uh, sweet. Now I'm being super cautious about it. Has little girl noticed that unspent reef ponds are kept each floor? No need to get every single pond. 
Hmm. Good luck. Mafia has opened it. Huh, I don't believe you. Can't bother you. Interesting. Also, what are they like re-deads? What's going on here? Dancing around. I don't trust you. Get everything. Missed one already. Apparently. <laughs> Alright, cool. Hello. I like the Yoshi like drums from Super Mario <laughs> Um Sunshine or uh like even like uh Super Mario World or Super Mario 3. Swag. You said it, man. Can I blow these up? Don't, don't you do it. Wait. Here we go. I'm seven. Up. Oh wait, maybe I need to do uh Nope, didn't work. I tried. Uh we'll go this way. That's good, but is that out really all? Is that it? I feel like I'm missing something. I missed a pawn, but it's not the same. I'm guessing I have everything. I'm looking around here. And feels right. <laughs> These don't blow up, right? Just for decoration? Okay. Suit yourself. We'll keep on keeping on. Throw stuff at me. Eh. Ooh. Seaside spaghetti. <laughs> Lots of spaghetti. of like running around feels so good. Seven. I feel like that was everything. I didn't get one of those colorful maps on this level though. I, I might have missed it. Or this uh, space rather. You be very cautious and check. I like the vibes here though. It's interesting. It's a it's a cool contrast to what we've gotten used to. Did I get everything? I don't want to miss anything again. I don't want to miss a thing. I had to have gotten it all. I've been really careful. Just these pawns. Which are you doing? Oh, there it is. There it is. Okay. Hey, <laughs> you sneaky. Go down. Let go. Let go. Please let go. How do I make her? There we go. Okay. Knew there had to be one here. And I missed the other one, sadly. But what can you do? Oh, never mind. <laughs> I got it. Too bad that I I missed the last, the first one rather. Interesting. Oh, 
thought we were about to get a boss fight or something. Oh, I didn't get all the pawns. I thought it would automatically come towards me. I feel like I have to go all the way back there to figure out what those map things are, though. Mafia's Grand Voyage? I missed the first page, I think. Hmm. <laughs> oh, they crash? Ooh, that's the page I missed. Oh, I guess it just... Ooh. Chance time! Chance time! There we there go. There we go. Hair color? No. Ooh. Uh, I don't know. I'm gonna try one more time. <gasps> Ooh, new remix? Ho oh, ho. Wiggity, wiggity, wiggity. What? That's why I said story timer. I get you. That makes sense. I like it. I like that switch up. All right, guys. So, the the rift is where they crashed. Oh. I hit the hat instead of my head. Oh. <laughs> oh. All right, so here's what we're going to do. I'm I'm very short on time, sadly. But what I want to do is I want to go back. I'm going to get that last page. <gasps> Intruder alert. We've got a band. Wait, we haven't even met them. Are they in one of the other levels? <laughs> I want to go back and get that last page because it's going to pain me if I don't. And then I think we're going to have to call it a stream. But hang tight because I want to figure out what that last page is. What's interesting is, so logically... I missed the first page, which had to have been on that first floor that Link said I missed something on. Um, so I missed that first page, but I think I'm missing the last page in game. Like, I feel like there's one more page to that story that we got. So it it's interesting how sometimes logically you get, I got everything but the first page, but the story in game, I'm missing the last page. But that's normal. It happens. You have to you have to select it from the action select. Is that is that so? Back to hub. Let's try. I definitely don't want to run around and waste time. So thanks for that tip. I'm gonna try it. So hopefully, I man, I have so many D and T campaign ideas, but I don't have any of my D and D stuff for friends. Well, I'll tell you this, Pixel Knight. I know that there are lots of cool communities out there that play D on D. -on -D. Oh, Digimon! What? D&D &D on Twitch. There are people who play... I don't know if they do, like, random people. You know what I mean? But there are communities, I'm sure. So, um, I'm, I'm sure you know about that. But uh, I'm sure you can find a cool group of peeps to play with. Ah, that makes sense. You're right. You're right. Good call. Thank you for that link. Otherwise, I would have been like, what? It's not here. And I would have really been pushing it on time. So you demand as per usual. So let's get that last page. Oh, where is it? It didn't look hard enough. Yeah, it's right there up on the building. Right in front of my face. That's the last one. I've got to go through again. Okay. Very well. Let's do this quick. Let's speed run it. Now you have to collect all of them again? Oof. That's a bummer. That's okay. Let me do it real quick. Wow. <laughs> At least I think no problem. We'll do it real quick. Where 
are we? Uh, this is the quickest way to get it. That's it for this level, I think. I'm calling them levels, but they're not really levels. Like how there's a little break here. Flying through it, flying. Oh, that hit me. Get out of here. I got by him. never tried going back for them? No? Well, I recommend it. We're gonna get them all. Wait, did I miss one? No, it's here. I did get it, right? Four out of six. Did I get it on this one? I don't want to have to go back and do it again. I think I did. Uh, my brain, I'm trying to remember. There's not one on this floor? Okay. I didn't think so. Um, there's the one that's hiding there. I'll go. <gasps> oh, I didn't mean to do that. Being a little too careless. Oh. No! I. Take it away from me? It did not. Oops. Okay. Wait a second. No, I did miss one. Hecaroni, I still missed one. There was one on that floor. Well, son of a gun. Um, oof. Oof a doof. There are only five pages? It says there's six, though. It says there's six. Heck. One more time. One more time. I wish it didn't take so long to load here. Now, now is the time I'm feeling the load times. Superhero, that's a good question, Pixel Knight. Um, a tie between Batman and Batman Beyond? Probably for me, Batman's classic. I love Batman. But I probably would have to go with... Um, you know what? I should stop. I shouldn't give it another shot. I want to. It said it up... It said it at the... It said... Five out of six. Here, we'll jump in real quick, but I'm not going to be able to do it. Um, let's go back. Um, but so my favorite superhero is Spider-Man. I just find his banter hilarious, and um, I just grew up with Spider-Man. So let's see. So here we are. All right, so am I hiding it? Yep. My hat's hiding it. One out of six. Okay. So let's see if I can... I actually am going to try real quick. <laughs> so it pains me to not get it. I'm going to just knock it out real quick. Alright. Cool. I wonder if I missed that one. I might have missed that easy one right in front of my face. Which is really silly. I don't feel like I did, but... Stranger things have happened. Stranger things. Okay. Four. Good. So it's behind my head. So two out of six. There's one. All right. 
Yeah, there had to have been one somewhere that I missed. Because I got all of them but that first page the first time. Whoa. I cannot hit him. There we go. There was an extra one here. Yep, there was one here that I missed. That's my bad. There were two on this floor, that's why. Oops, a daisy. There we go, now we're gonna get all of them easy. All right, and there's two left, and I've already opened that, so we're good. Cool, this will be, now I've got it, you're right. Okay. Voila, okay. Didn't take too long. Okay, we've got one more. Yeah, so there aren't, there is no page on this floor. You're right. Okay. I like the little extra drum beat on this level. It's great. Or this stage. So it makes you think there's something there, but there's not, so. Hey, Combat Wombat, how are you? Nice name. Oh, he, did he did he hit me? Right, let's get that last piece there. And we'll be golden. Oop, I messed up. Oh, that's awesome. I love it. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. Well, I hope you feel better. This down. Good. All right. We got them all. Oops. Well, that's okay. We got plenty. Okay. Six out of six. You can see it. We did it. All right. I don't know if it saves that I got all six, but we got it. Here we go! All right. <laughs> Let me go ahead and look real quick. All right, so Mafia's Grand Voyage. So they, they're at a fish factory. They're dreaming about the island life. They set sail for island life, say bye to all their lady friends. They have fun, beach balling it, eating the huge pork chop or whatever that is. They find the island, they declare it Mafia Town, and that's that. That makes mm. sense. Cool. So I don't know if we unlock that to uh, check that out later, but I dig it. It was totally worth finding that last page just for that last picture. All right, so let's see. Oh, you know what? This is perfect. So I can see the one and only Beta64 is streaming. He was super cool and raided us yesterday. It would fill my heart with joy if we could try to pay it forward back to him you can't view them later oh that's too bad well i'm glad we got to experience that together just now it worked out okay so here we are this is a great stopping point guys i've got to rush off here but this has been an awesome stream i super hope that you'll join me for fancy friday excuse me where for the very first time i'll be wearing this top hat so i sure hope you'll join me Please, if you haven't already, hang out in the Discord with us. I also have a Twitter. I won't bother with that. But look over here. There's a thing called a Clippy Raid. If you're on desktop, you can click on that. Click on that. Click that. And uh, you can send on the, the cool vibes to Beta64. So let's wish him a great stream. It looks like he is decked out in some awesome attire as well. So let's do it. Raid Parade, friends. Beta 64, let's raid. But, uh, yeah, so... Though they're... Lore, though, yeah, I get you. I like it. I'm all about it. Well, guys, thank you so much for this awesome Thursday, yours day. I'm, I'm Carl Tatius, and I 
We'll see you tomorrow. So until then, have a wonderful evening. Let's raid the one and only Beta 64. So until then, good night and goodbye. See ya.